Hey guys, so today I have the Tarte Baba Bomb Moisturizer and I definitely had to pick this up once I saw it listed. It looked pretty good and I was further impressed that Tarte used my favorite type of packaging with it. Uh, and overall, I'm really liking it. I love the fact that it's a fragrance-free moisturizer. It's also vegan and also pretty affordable. I believe it's about $39, but if you pick it up at Ulta with a coupon, uh, you can get usually like the 20% off. So it was a pretty good deal. And overall, I'm pretty impressed with this moisturizer. It's ultra hydrating. Um, and I love the packaging. Did I mention that? Uh, it's got kind of a creamy texture to it, not super gel texture. And I know people will ask, uh, could this be a dupe for the Proteiny cream? And I would say this isn't as much like the Proteiny cream as it is more so, in my opinion, similar to the La La Retro cream from Drunk Elephant. Uh, it's pretty thick and uh, moisturizes pretty good. If you have oily skin, I have a feeling you're not going to be totally in love with this, especially in the summertime, but perhaps a little bit more so uh, in the winter because it kind of dries to a kind of a kind of a nice radiant texture to it. It doesn't set to a super dry finish. Uh, the one thing I do want to mention, though, for some of you out there, um, is that the biggest concern I have with it is if you have acne-prone skin, it does have quite a few ingredients that are uh, acneogenic, and I'm going to list those because there is quite a few, so be careful with it. Uh, butylene glycol, uh, olive fruit oil, palmitic acid, stearic acid, uh, let's see, uh, avocado oil, sorbitan olate, uh, mystric acid, and then uh, sodium hyaluronic. Some people are kind of sensitive to that. So it does have several ingredients that are acneogenic, so be cautious using it uh, if you have that issue, or definitely use it with a uh, alpha hydroxy acid beforehand or after. Uh, it layers very nicely. I was able to layer it with my sunscreen and my vitamin C oil, and I haven't had any issues with it at all. So uh, overall, I'm really liking it. I don't see it as a dupe for the Proteiny, sadly. Uh, it's more similar to the Lala Retro Cream, I would say. Uh, but super hydrating, no fragrance, no scent at all, no alcohol, uh, lots of good hydrating ingredients. The Babasu is in there, olive oil, uh, sodium hyaluronic, things like that. So overall, there's a lot to like about it unless you have very acne-prone skin or even not necessarily very acne-prone skin. So. Uh, a little bit of it goes a long way. I like using it in my morning routine, in my evening routine. However, in the summer, so far I found in my morning routine, just a little small amount goes a long way. If I layer it too much, I will be oily by like midday. So uh, finding it more helpful in my evening routine, but loving the packaging, love how affordable it is, fragrance-free, alcohol-free, uh, some good hydrating ingredients in there. Uh, in terms of like antioxidants, it's got like the green tea oil or green tea extract and things like that in there, but not a ton of other antioxidants. But personally for me, I'd still rather go with an airless jar any day, uh, even if it doesn't have a ton of necessarily air and light sensitive ingredients. I just find it's much more easy to dispense, less messy, things like that. So I know Tarte has really been impressing me lately, so hopefully they'll keep going. Uh, their Truth or Dare serum, I really like that too. This one's good. I just tried their micellar water last night and uh, really liking that so far, although I've only used it twice now. So, but so far, Tarte's really knocking it out of the park for me. So uh, anyway, I'm interested if you guys have a chance to pick this up yet uh, and if you have what your thoughts are. So definitely leave a comment. I love hearing from you guys. Ike is going to take a nap in the dirty bathtub. Hi, Ike. It's so dirty. Sorry, guys. You know what? Both my dogs have to drink out of the faucet of the bathtub. They don't like drinking out of a dish. So, random note for the day. Anyway, thank you guys so much, and I'll see you tomorrow.